Hello, my name is Kirsty and I am the Children's Ministry Officer for the Diocese of Derry and Info. This year things have been slightly different, but as we get back to school and back to church, we have a reason to celebrate. We are also coming into the time of harvest, where we have a chance to say thank you to God for all the things that he gives us, for all the produce, the vegetables, the fruit, the fish, the animals, everything that he created for us. To say thank you to the farmers and all those who work hard on the land to provide for us, for lorry drivers and transport drivers who keep the system going, and for shopkeepers for selling and producing everything else that we need. We really are so lucky and so blessed and we have the right to take this chance to say thank you to God for all that he has done. So in our diocese this year as we celebrate harvest maybe in a slightly different way we want to encourage you to get creative. So we are having an art competition. Harvest at home is what we're calling it and what we want you to do is to grab your bible or your storybook and read the parable of the sower. And when you, when you read that parable, we want you to think about what Jesus is telling the disciples and what the parable means. Then we want you to get creative. We want you to come up with a way of telling that story. So grab your paint, your Play-Doh or dough, pens, glue, your phone, and do videos or photographs. And just think of a different way that you can tell the story of the parable of the sower. We want you to be as creative as you can. We're giving you until the 16th of October and we want you to post your entries to the diocesan office. The website has the address or you can email them to me at kirsty at daringyourfoe.org. Once we get the emails, we're going to have a judge come in and look at them. We have got different age categories and so you can enter in your age category. Make sure that your entry has your name your age and address to contact you and what parish you belong to. We have great prizes. So the first prize in each category is going to be a tablet. And we've got prizes as well for second and third place. And we're really excited about this and we want you to take part. So your challenge is to come up with a new way, a creative way of telling the parable of the sower using art. So get all your art supplies together read the story in the Bible or your children's Bible and think of a different way that you can tell the parable of the sower. There will be more information sent out to parishes so keep an eye on it and we really do look forward to seeing what you can come up with. Hello my name's Peter uh, bringing greetings from the beautiful uh, Derg Valley at this time. Just want to share a, a few words about an exciting a uh, project, a joint project with our diocesan children's ministry Seeds, along with our diocesan youth ministry Derry Rufo Youth. We are partnering together at this time, uh, leading up to harvest, to produce an exciting harvest challenge to engage with our children and young people in primary and secondary school. At this time, when many of our children's and youth ministries cannot meet uh, face to face or certainly in the same way, we want to get the message out that God is with us and God is leading us. Children and young people, you are not forgotten. We very much uh, want to engage with you in exciting new ways at this time. And so what are Seeds and Derry Rafo Youth going to do? Well, we are inviting every parish in the diocese to get behind our Harvest Challenge uh, project. We're asking children uh, and young people uh, to get creative, uh, to produce a, a, a poster uh, or a, a, a video or a, a photograph with, with, with graphics or even a, a TikTok video with music. We want you to portray uh, something of your thanks to God uh, using uh, the parable of the sower. There are different uh, age uh, brackets uh, in this project and some very exciting uh, prizes uh, which will be decided before our diocesan synod. Get behind our harvest challenge 
and see what God will do in us and through us as we continue to find new ways to proclaim and lift high the name of Jesus. Every challenge is an opportunity for the Christian and this time is an opportunity for us to draw closer to God and closer to each other. So children, young people, parents, families, get behind our harvest challenge and let's see what God will do. Thank you and God bless.